victory dance, victory dance. Some people ask if I was doing a victory dance, and I am victory dance. Um, I am not a Democrat. I'm an independent, but um, you know what? I'm I'm I'm, I'm just people are lumping with the Democrats. So I'm just gonna take it for now. But um, Donald Trump did a thing last night where he slowly admitted that he can't use Darrell as his property and that he will be using what I told him to use. Cam David, not that he listens to my stuff. I'm sure other people came to that conclusion because, you know, reasons. Smart. Not being dumb and using a... Yeah, yeah, just reasons. Reasons. But, um, yeah, that's a huge win for us. I do think that he announced it when he did to um, take away some heat from the whole Kurdish thing because he is losing quite a bit of Republican support for what he is doing to the Kurds. But I think that he did not um, want, what was I going to say? He did want to use it. If he could have gotten away with it, he would have used Durrell. I also think that he wanted the free advertising, which is definitely against the Emoluments Clause yet again. But the fact that there was enough pushback from Republicans, there was enough pushback from Democrats that he was forced to walk it back before I even got my video uploaded. I recorded it. It took, takes about 30 minutes to upload a video sometimes. So in between that and the time that I was uploading, he literally had to walk it back. So yeah, that made me happy. And I will fully admit and sit here and quote and be like, Trump couldn't break the law. Yay, 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 yay. Um, it's just a huge piece of news that made me very, very happy. It's a huge victory for us. It is a huge victory for the Constitution, which I am such a fan of. And I am so motherfucking happy that he could not use Darrell to profit off of. And once again, just go watch my video. It's one of his largest money makers. It's down almost 60 to 70% of its revenue since Trump became president because no one wants to be associated with King Ladouche. So, yeah, he was trying to advertise for it. It has bed bugs. It's just not adding up so well for him. I'm sure he'll make up his revenue through Saudi Arabian princes, booking out hotel suites and, and uh, freaking, you know, flying military to his freaking uh, European hotels. I'm sure he'll make it up somehow, but... For now, he can't use it. It's also not distracting from the Kurdish thing like he wanted it to do. Neither is the is it distracting from the fact that he broke the law and the whole Ukraine thing, which I think was also something he was trying to distract from. All it did was make him look worse. Here's a victory on our end. Yay. Alright guys, I will see you tomorrow. We'll talk about Rudolph Giuliani um, and a couple other news things. I'm just really tired and I'm not going to push hard videos right now as I just don't have the energy. So I don't want to give you crap, and I'm just, I'm so tired. Just a few videos that I've done are wearing me out. Um, but yeah, I'll see you tomorrow for just the last couple of videos, hopefully, and bye.